Hey there guys, today I'm gonna to do an update video on my pallet wood axe handle. Currently I am camping in the White Mountains of Arizona and I figured it would be a great place to do an update. Um, pretty much everybody liked this video about making the axe handle out of pallet wood, uh, but the big question people had is, was it going to be durable since the laminations would take away the flexibility and things like that? And to be honest, <laughs> so far I've only used it as a lightweight uh, kindling splitter at home. Uh, so I'm gonna give it a real test, chop down a real tree um, it won't be anything super huge or super small maybe like 10 or 12 inches in diameter and we'll see if this thing can actually chop it down without breaking into a thousand pieces fingers crossed <laughs> Okay guys, the deed is done. You saw this handle hold up to chopping down a real tree. Was it the largest tree? No, but it certainly wasn't the smallest. Um, it was about 10 to 12 inches in diameter and overall the handle held up very well. Uh, there's no cracks or splits in the laminations, which I know that was the uh, biggest concern with most people. However, I will point out my fitting job of fitting the head was probably the big weak point. There is a little bit of a gap there as the handle did loosen up just a little bit. But uh, so, you know, <laughs> but that's really a, a fault of mine. So overall held up well, I'm happy with it and I probably will never chop down a tree again with it. It's more of a wall hanger and a kindling splitter. So anyway, thanks for watching guys. If you're interested in uh, watching the original video, I'll put a link uh, up there so you can see it. And then uh, as always, we'll see you next time. Sing. Cold winds are calling skies. <laughs> Go get it. Here.